Hey everyone, Elias here, and welcome to my first share video. I'm starting this informational video series so that you, the members of the Kimmer and CSA, um, can learn what to do with all the delicious produce that you get every week in your share. Uh, let's start off by finding out what we got in our share this week. So today's share consists of one bok choy, two bunches of mustard, 10 ounces of Swiss chard, six garlic scapes, one head of romaine lettuce, one head of escarole, one bunch of assorted herbs, um, cilantro, dill, and parsley, two zucchinis, one bunch of arugula, and four turnips. Today we are going to make two dishes, a vegetable stir-fry and a greenhouse salad. To start, put olive oil in a stir-fry pan and add the garlic scapes. The next step is to add the chopped Swiss chard in. Next, add in the chopped bok choy. Then I added the zucchini. Make sure that the things that take longer to cook find their way at the bottom, where the most heat is. I added half a cup of water to allow the vegetables to steam better. Cover the pot with the lid and let cook for up to 10 minutes. Make sure to routinely stir it so that one part is not burnt and the other raw. After cooking for around 10 minutes, I added some soy sauce for flavor. I then added the cilantro followed by the parsley. This was minutes before the dish was done so that they still had a bit of crunch to them. Cook for another couple of minutes and then you are done. For the salad you will need a large bowl like the one I have here. Add the lettuce. Rip or slice it into pieces. Add the escarole the same way as you did the lettuce. Then add in the four chopped turnips. Add in any leftover parsley or cilantro from the stir fry into the salad. Then add some sliced or ripped arugula along with a couple leaves of chopped mustard greens. Toss a couple of garlic scapes on top of the salad and mix it with your hands. Then you're good to go. Thank you for watching. Uh, please leave any comments down below on how uh, your version of this dish went um, or anything that I could change uh, to make it easier to follow. Um, and if you like this video, please be sure to leave a like down below. And if you really loved it, Please be sure to subscribe.